Here's some new Harry Potter merchandise that I recently received from EMP, including an exclusive item. Let me show you what I got. Last Christmas, I was lucky to receive this Dermastrong t-shirt from a family member. And it was only after that I discovered that it was from EMP. Now, I had heard of EMP before and knew that they did a alt range of fashion and merchandise for fandoms like Harry Potter. And they recently did a Fantastic Beast range. But unfortunately, that range was mainly for ladies, so I couldn't really be included in that particular magic. But after browsing their website, I was overjoyed to realize that they had quite a large range for men and could you imagine how excited I was when they contacted me and advised that they were going to be sending over some goodies. So I'm going to go through the items that I was kindly gifted from EMP and the first item, even though this is for ladies, I did choose this because it is the exclusive item that they do and it is this Marauder's Map Scarf. Now, you may be wondering, why did I go for a lady's scarf? Not that I am opposed to wearing scarves because I have a lot of Harry Potter scarves, but I just thought this was so pretty and I do love the Marauders map quite a lot. And what I would, you know, use it for is like backgrounds for photos and stuff. Uh, I did a party, like a Harry Potter dinner party a while back and used these like type of you know, lightweight scarves as like backgrounds and drops for a lot of the things because they're so, cat, you know, eye-catching and lovely. So that's what I would be using it for. Or, you know, if the fancy took me and, you know, some, uh, you know, female friend was looking for a Harry Potter gift, I could gift this to them. So it's kind of twofold. So if I don't end up keeping it myself, then of course I can gift it to someone else. But that is the first item. And I just think it is wonderful. It's so pretty. There are a lot of unique products online and you know me, I love Harry Potter t-shirts so if I can get one, I'm going to get one and of course I did and it was this neon Hogwarts crest t-shirt. Now, I love the Hogwarts crest and I love it even more when Ravenclaw is represented by the correct eagle and I know there are Ravenclaws that follow this channel and will be overjoyed to see that there is an eagle representing Ravenclaw. Now I am in Hufflepuff but as you can see the colours don't represent any of the Hogwarts houses. Now we're used to red, green, yellow and blue but I love this so much because it does encapsulate blue and yellow but like pink and neon it's so bright, it's so different, it's so like Harry Potter t-shirt but really cool at the same time so that is why I went for that one because I love for this design so much and it's so unique and will be an amazing addition to my Harry Potter t-shirt collection, which I have quite a lot of t-shirts, so this is definitely one of the most unique ones that I own. Next clothing item that I did get was, of course, another Harry Potter t-shirt, but this is another very unique one that I saw, and it is a Voldemort t-shirt, and I love it because it's kind of like an 80s feel about it, and it's very subtle, so like if you were passing and regular muggles were having a look at your t-shirt, they may not realise that this is a Harry Potter type, which I do love some subtle Harry Potter references. But I also love it because it's kind of camp as well, like Voldemort is quite a camp character, like all the villains are, and it's like this, this and it's just such a funny t-shirt, but I love that it's so cool. And I will be trying them on later so you can see what they look like on me, but I think this is just a fabulously evil and camp and Harry Potter t-shirt. So that's why I went for that one. So I'm very, very pleased with this one. Just so different. The next item that isn't a piece of clothing is this Ministry of Magic pin badge. Now, contrary to what you may imagine, you think there would be a lot of Ministry of Magic items around. But if you are an adult Harry Potter fan, and imagine where you might be working in the Wizarding World. It's more than likely that we'll be working in the Ministry of Magic. Of course, there are many other occupations, but as we know, a lot of Wizarding occupation is within the Ministry of Magic. So if you wanted to, you know, have a pin badge or something to represent the Ministry of Magic, there isn't a lot of things around. But I saw this and thought that this would be a great addition. And I know some people that love cosplaying auras and 
just Ministry of Magic workers that this would be a cute little addition to their wardrobe that they can add onto bags, they can add on to clothing and jackets and stuff, and that's what, how I would be using it. So that is why I decided to go for this. Now the final item is another one that the Ravenclaws will be happy about, and maybe even Ilver Morning, like students visiting Hogwarts, which I love. And it is this quite fabulous and quite luxurious Hogwarts hoodie. Now I love me some Hogwarts attire, and this even has the f Hogwarts phrase on which we know translates to never t tickle a sleeping dragon. But I liked that it was different because it had maroon and navy, which is why I said possibly the Ilver Morning students that visit Hogwarts may like this one, you know, visiting and they sort of purchasing a hoodie. Like, can you imagine that Hogwarts had a gift store? This is in my own mind, of course. And But it's not just Hogwarts and quite a luxurious, like it's, it's really thick hoodie, but it also has embroidery on. And this embroidered crest is fabulous once again because it's not a standard crest again without the Hogwarts standard colors in there of you know red green yellow and blue but this is just in navy and gray and again with the eagle so Ravenclaws will be happy with that as well as am I with this fabulous crest on I love some magical embroidery you know that and that is why I chose that quite fabulous hoodie which I do wear hoodies quite a lot. I prefer ones without the zips. So that's it for this Harry Potter merchandise haul from EMP. A massive thank you to them for gifting me these items. Thank you so, so much. I will be leaving links to all the products to look out for those. If you have enjoyed this video, then please do me a favor and click that subscribe button and turn on notifications so that each and every week when there's a new video, you'll be notified. Be sure to give this video a like. And with that, remember the Wizarding World is just one spell away.